part of what we're after is saying, look, man, I don't care how fucked up you are. If you've got a prison record, if you've been out on the streets, that's almost a prerequisite to come in our program. I mean, and who does that? I'm Marina Dewey with Up Rocks. From the mosh pit to the kitchen, this punk rocker went from protesting our broken social system to trying to fix it. We started a program called Empower LA, which is a job training program for young men and women aging out of foster care, older women home from prison. LA Kitchen is a charitable organization. Now, it gets donated food. The donated food is used to train men and women in the job training program, who in turn manage and guide volunteers. I just wanted to not only feed people a better meal, but I wanted to lift people up and show that they had a skill. There's people out there who need a role to play, to have a gift, something to offer. Anybody that has a criminal record believe that they cannot be employed. A lot of times you can't. 76% of former inmates say that it is nearly impossible to find work after being released. But now we have programs that help people like me. I was on drugs. Drugs lead to crime. Crime leads to jail. It was very difficult looking for work. I tried and tried. I came to the conclusion that I was not hireable. A great nonprofit doesn't try and fix the problem, it reveals the power of community to solve the problem working side by side. Teresa is one of the first graduates from the Empower program, and now think about it, she guides every volunteer that comes through and virtually every student. So she's kind of like our North Star. Me and my coworkers, we're happy with what we're doing for people. We just had a student that worked the Academy Awards. I mean, it can't get better than that. You know, we feed people great meals, we give people great jobs, and we make money while we do it. I mean, what's not to like? LA Kitchen's always open. You have a role here, we want you here. Get on down. <laughs>